Hello everyone, welcome back to Shadow's Awakening. <clears throat> so last episode, I... I was getting a, a griffin egg. Again, I forgot to look up what an eerie Prepare is. For death. Oh god! Okay, so apparently the tentacles just keep popping up for a few seconds. Hmm. Feel the power of the mage. Yeah, nice try. I mean this one, we're still in the Shadow Realm. Oh, I see it. It's kind of fucked up that I, I can just come into the Shadow Realm and basically pause every enemy. You know, I don't even have to fight the, the Griffins. I will, but I don't have to. Really? Ah. There we go. Uh, there is one egg I can take. So take it. Here comes the mother of all griffins. If the mother will let me, you shall fall. Uh oh. Hmm. I did not wish it to come to this. Damn. Zar is an animal. Which I guess is kind of the point. Huh. Five percent lightning resistance. I'll take the willpower. Ooh. Very nice. Probably should have healed up back there, but whatever. It's just a little bit of HP. There. 
Now what's in here? Really? I'm actually kind of disappointed. Although I suppose that's a bit of a beggars can't be choosers thing. I mean, they can, but they shouldn't. <clears throat> nope, just dark holes. Well, I'm going to need to complete these side missions before I venture into the level 14 mission. So I don't think I'd be able to survive that. Yeah, that's interesting. Open the inventory and equip better weapon. Unless you don't have one. Why do the flames switch to green when on this side? Must I do everything myself? It just seems weird. Like, of all things, why do the flames turn green? Just one of those things. Aha! There's an area here I haven't explored. Not quite sure when the damage immunity. Right, this must be with the golem. Uh, I'm not quite sure how the meteor actually deals damage, because it seems like it falls. What others have begun, but then shall finish. nothing happened. Uh, so, sorry, like it seems like it fell and then nothing happened for a short period of time and then the enemies took damage, but only on a very, very small radius. Ah. It actually does mark the cenotaph or whatever. Very useful. This place looks better in shadow. Always a deal to be till you need some help. I have a griffin egg, although it was not an easy acquisition. You yeah. found an eerie in jagged peaks. Astonishing. As agreed, you may take anything you like from my store as a reward. What can I do for you? The captain was happy to provide a replacement manifest. I mean, she was ordered to by her general. You are an endless source of astonishment. You must take what you wish from my stall as your reward. That's everything. You are truly remarkable. Thank you. No my problem. My debt to you is incalculable. But I am still a merchant, and I do not trade in incalculable commodities. Really? Unwise to return to Thal under the circumstances. I shall proceed to Kyalisa once I have made the necessary arrangements. You have many questions, I... Alright, now let's see 
what you have. We should hold on to yes, this for later. I'll take this at a I'll take this as a free reward. Right, he doesn't have anything for the demon. Makes sense. Stun chance, life steal chance. Hmm. Fine suit. Right, first I should actually change the equipment. You know, just so they have the best stuff equipped. And that way, I don't have to, to wonder if I should stel sell something or not. Alright, I think that should be good Have you enough. Moved on to Do you need some help? So let's see, here, Chieftain's Bow. Loses weapon damage, increases survivability due to life steal. Here, just increases armor. Loses Pierce Resistance, gains Slash Resistance. Agility and Movement Speed. This could be useful. See, the thing is, evasion, endurance, willpower, that's more for Evia. Although, Zard does have low level equipment. <clears throat> and these boots are only usable by Evia. Yeah, I'll, I'll get these for Zard then. Here, should I get the, the fine kitten suit? Let's see, agility and movement speed. Hmm. 
All right. I probably should not have started to sell this stuff because the other guys could use the, could use it. Oh well. Seriously, I don't get attribute points. Weird. Just leave that for now. I shall show thee true power. Right in stash, because I should store the pre order stuff. I don't have to, but I want to. Hmm. Seems like level 14 is the lowest. Well, I do remember that there was a an area where I rescued the <clears throat> the princess. Um, it said to Royal Tomb Three or something like that. Okay, where's the demon? <laughs> Doesn't seem to be a one. All right. For a second there, I thought the the shield had deflected the poison because of uh, how how well uh, how coincidental those things w were. Okay, that was weird. Yeah, yeah, you just like gotcha. Can't be slain. No slain. Oh, the mystery of what? What's up with these these games and this game? Sorry. And weird names like Krenza, Evia, and whatever the hell the archer dude is. I honestly don't remember his name, I just remember that it's super weird. This tunnel reeks of dark magic. Alright. Last puzzle, and then I'm off. Yeah, 
Easy enough. Whoop. Wait, what happened there? Oh, it's a ranged thing. You see? It, it's hard to spot, but there's like some distortion. Well, anyway, this episode is a bit shorter than, than usual, but I do need sleep. So, yeah. <clears throat> anyway, Ko Kogog Ak. I, I don't know. Anyway, as always, I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you again next time.